money. You too won't do your own name in ceremony. What do you mean so? It means that you accept the picking. True outs. That means you know how that that picking one day. That's why you, you, you follow your picking, go marry the girl, you did the general name ceremony, you do your own name ceremony. So for African TV, where they ask, say, whether Baba accept that picking, yes, he accept that picking in every legal way. He accept the picking. Because if follow a picking, go marry that girl when she get pregnant. If not, if I tell the picking, say, I not go follow you, go. Madam, Maybe Madam, wait, Madam, make Madam, that you, born. No, you carry on, you carry on. Mm. Make a hypothesis waiting you the talk so. Mm. Uh, I can't see one video recently because me, I'll uh, be papa to three picking. Uh, and uh, as a woman, they get pregnant, we they celebrate them, we they take picture. I come see video where mobile day there, where we may get pregnant, where the pregnancy they show. You see? Okay. So yes. when we see when we see that one, mm -hmm. it, it, it be say something don't happen between man and woman. Yes. And Bele don't they go. We come yeah. see the Bele for inside picture. Yeah. We look natural. Where we go come, no thing say then they hide Bele. Yes. For Bele day, we see Bele. Exactly. And the man we do the job, you know. At that yeah, time, yeah. things say not being do am. Mm -hmm. We wouldn't be our own fancy. Exactly. Where would they take for another people's headache? Carry on, madam. Carry on. Carry on. <laughs> so since Baba not tell the Pekin say no, we not go marry yet. So let the girl born. When he born, we will come go check whether the Pekin are our own before anything. He not do like that. He carry on. He go marry. He do name ceremony. He do your name ceremony. That means he one thousand accept that girl. He one thousand percent accept that picking. So that one the number one answer for African TV. African TV. Secondly, you they forget say all of us we we be human being. You say the only time you don't see women if they come outside call shot. If they come outside call do this. African TV. Now only Coco, Baba say you chop. <laughs> when you don't cry, 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 cuss and cuss and cuss and cuss and. Not to talk of one person where everybody they bully for one year. You expect to make it come out, they laugh. I be not be blood the flow for her body. She know they feel pain. Eh? Coco, now Baba say you chop. Oh. When you don't cry, 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 cry. From platform to platform, they cuss and cuss and cuss and cuss and. Make we know the talk, wait till we pain when we know fit take. Make we know the same, make another person accept her. It no good like that. At all. Because, totally, that picking when you just say, go do DNA. No be you get her. Now, since that they ask you, say, go bring letter of your 70 church your this thing. You no agree. They leave you. What are the police and? Is they court and? Which one can be our own inside? Why would they play God on top of people matter? It's not good like that. As if they say police don't they handle the matter. Judge, court don't they handle the matter. Now for us to the watch and see. Why this matter be like this? Where be say it not the end. Now because we want, we want, we, we, we they say, now this person they must arrest. Uh, uh, the article you first talk say even matters where small past this one police they handle around and sources they come out why because me and you don't put eye for that case we allow police to do their job but this one we no more allow police to do their job we won't play the police we won't play the jury we won't play the courts let police court oh yeah make with the, the one this matter for don't go far since but uh, court police yeah and say Ah, see as it be for she they, they say no be this one, then this one. We don't do our investigation, but no be so it be. So as 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 when they drag the matter, then they drag the matter, as when they drag the matter, then they drag the matter. If you can't talk, say one small girl, when they tell where her husband they are life, where it be celebrity, you know noir, me no noir. You no know, talk, say because your husband a celebrity, make it come the show off, make it come the booger. 
Now, now your husband don't die. You can't talk, say he no Gucci, he no police, he no senator, he no this, he no that. Where the influence when the husband they are alive? Why the husband no use that influence? How come wife go get all those influence? Husband no go get her. Where if they run up and down, say that they beat her? Eh? Because at times we know they think if this man can't get all this influence. How the husband no come no say his wife get all this influence. If he, if he, if he, if they get get all this connection, how the husband no no? I bet she no utilize those connection when she deal with her husband. How she take get the connection without her husband knowing? I be it as you deal with your wife. You no go know if your wife get connections, if she get network, if she get doings. You go they see him, it go they happen. Because all of a sudden, the man can't die, connection just can't come for the girl. It's no good like that. Because we no more accept the truth. Now make with the talk all these unbelievable lies. Of what use, of what gain is that small picking to, to governor, to this person, to that? Where they will come they protect her? Of what use? Not be this country where we die, where we die, where Bola get die. Till tomorrow we don't know. When the lady will die, till tomorrow no. Who be with me? Make we the top truth. Make we allow police. Make we allow court do their job. If they say this one as suspect, now they know why they say this one as suspect. Make we see how everything won't play out. No go talk, say, why they not lock the house? Why they not do this? Why they not do that? Why they not do this one? We are you there? No. They had a reason why they did not lock the house. They, if, when did they do this thing? They said, no, sir, now me give injection. Now when I give injection... Uh, I see, you have to be fair with your timing. Eh? You have to be fair with your timing. TV, let her, look, African television, mute yourself. Please, thank you. Now, yes. now well, give madam, injection. Madam, 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 make I vano, know, make I know small. What did they happen on this black cab, they say? We go from platform to platform. They know African television, they know IT guy, they know Supreme Supreme, they know Paparano. We need to give the voice to others. So I open my platform so that we can all speak. I want people who want to speak that will not be allowed to speak on other platform to speak to Vano because we have to learn from ourselves. My own platform is not for the usual suspects. It's not for the usual people. It's for everybody. Wumi camp, Baba camp, our camp, Dawa class, Latisne, um, Honorable York, um, Ish guy. Um, I've blocked um, was he, a, a, a Comfy and Neymoli forever. But otherwise, anyone that wants to come up, come up and speak i am fed up of listening to the usual guys and women and the usual suspect i want the normal people on these corners of our black app to come and speak it is no popularity contest it is no i speak better than that person it is no english it is no yoruba that's why I want come and speak pigeon. Everybody understand pigeon for even Africa. Speak your pigeon so that they can say we are not speaking English because we are not speaking Yoruba or Igbo or Aousa. But pigeon for West Africa, for inside Africa where we do, even Zimbabweans and us and, and South Africans can understand pigeon. Pigeon is a mixture of broken English and English. So we need people to speak. We need not anybody's voice be suppressed. And I don't want any form of popularity on my platform. If you think you are a god or goddess, stay on your platform. If you want to engage with normal people, normal Nigerians, I'm not inviting you for any popularity contest. Just come on my platform, be real, be respectful, 
I'm not clapping for anybody. I am not whispering for anybody. I'm not giving anybody any kudos. We are not sharing trophy on this platform, my own platform. I'm not sharing anything with anybody. Nobody is grand though. Nobody is grand. Everybody has the same right as me. On this black app, my constitutional right as a Nigerian, my judicial right as a British, because I live in England and I have Britain's British citizenship, means I fight for my right and the actual constitution and the parliamentary right as a citizen, I work, I pay my taxes judiciously, I get what is due to me. And that is exactly what I want here. What's the topic today? The topic today is freestyle. Freestyle. Speak your mind. Look at the matters of the moment. Engage with your people. Be open. Be truthful. And for me, I haven't cursed anyone. I haven't dropped anyone. Um, I haven't fought anyone. And no one is coming here to come and use loose language and all that kind of stuff. So I go, we go, we go carry on. We go use our pigeon. We will pigeon profusely. They will learn. So let's be noble. Let's be useful. And let's be gallant. Let's respect ourselves as brothers and sisters. I am not here to come and engage with people because I've spoken to someone on WhatsApp. No. I do have people that are close to me. I engage with on WhatsApp. That's my problem. It's my number. If I give you my WhatsApp number, if you disrespect me, I will block you. That's okay. You, I give you number, you share it with people. If they engage with me, if I don't like them, I block them. Fuck that shit. I block you. I block your life. If you come to my DM and you talk shit, I'm okay. If you cost me from now on my DM, I'm okay. But if you go viral, like um, 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 waiting, then they call that woman comfy, and you have to go and drag me when I haven't done anything to you, I will leave you to finish your dragging. I will leave you for 24 hours after your dragging so that you can go into my profile and collect your information. Then after 24 hours, I will then block your life. God will block you. Nobility will block you. Uh, uh, prosperity will block you. Joy will block you. And that is what I will do. But I will let you carry on. You see, the thing is, I have people say, there's one stupid idiot that keeps coming to me and say, uh, how is your cat? Like, I, I am, uh, I don't have family. Look, you see, the cat is my daughter's pet. And the cat is a family pet. So in England and in life, when people that we nurture um, have passion, we encourage the passion. But one thing I will not do is to showcase my family life on social media for your own purpose. You understand what they talk? Because it's my private life. I am married to a beautiful woman very uh, enlightening education. I don't want to drop anybody. Just make it all. Let me see if I can make this. Who is that? Okay, thank you. Unmute yourself now. Okay, let me drop this person for, for a team. Who is that person? I'm uh, all of you. Okay, let me, let, me, let me not drop. Let me, let me just be kind. Yeah? So, Beautiful wife, beautiful children, two daughters, a son. Every, the two daughters are finished. They are living in their own, they've even bought their own properties. They're living their own life and all that. My son is at home with my missus and we are looking after ourselves. But I am not going to showcase my family life for you, for your benefit. Because why? You need to get your own life. Get your own life and balance it. So my own life, it is not on social media with my family, my wife, and my children. It is my own private deal. 
The last time they only say, uh, when you show, show us your bedroom, your papa, because the bedroom that I share with my wife is our solace. It's a sanctuary, you see. So I'm in my kitchen right now. I can show you outside. I can show you the garden. So let's be guarded. Let's be advised. Look, me, I'm versatile. Yoruba, I can speak. I can't speak Igbo or whatever, uh, Aosa. Uh, pigeon brings us together. And I can speak English just like Prince Charles. So. Because me, I, when I swallow dictionary, my vocabulary, I started learning my vocabulary since the age of 16 in Nigeria. I then my holy book was dictionary. So you can't you can't you can't school me on English. But when I'm engaged with my brothers and sister, we school ourselves on reasoning. We use the language that we understand. If I go to Nigeria and I go to the marketplace, am I gonna be speaking English? No. I am gonna say, Madam, ah, what's in the happen now? Ah, ah, this is your fish or oh, fresh or oh. ah, nah, this one, a new one, eh, this yam, a new yam. You understand? We are Nigerians before we left Nigeria. We cannot go back as dark as we are, as Nigerian as we are, and one come and say to people, you are better than them because you can speak some stupid English. No, our constitution is written in English. They cornered us, they pied us, they kick us, they caused confusion in our land, and they gave us their English constitution. When you, even if you go court safe, for inside Berekete, translator, they there. Two translators, one for people where no fee here, and one for people where they here. Waiting in a translator, English and pigeon, and where they do, and waiting happen, waiting set. Which kind of English you won't speak profusely? Where you no go understand, say you get to respect your brothers and sisters. How do you respect your brothers and sisters? You use a domestic currency. Our domestic currency is pigeon. I would say you anything pigeon. You reach airport from England, you get in there, you speak in English profusely. They will finish you. They will search everything. They will waste your time. So you enter there for this one, we shall speak English for the benefit of foreigners. But when you get to Nigeria, you are not a foreigner. When you get to Nigeria, your English ain't gonna do shit. Pardon my French, fuck that shit. I'm an American, look at me and they say, na lie, na lie, na lie. Because if you, if you be man, where you they handsome, you meet woman where they sexy, and you want that woman as your wife, but she know if you speak English. But you toast her, she understand your pigeon, and you marry her. Send her to school. Teach her how to speak English. But you've got a beautiful woman. You've won yourself a beautiful woman because why? You don't use your eroro. Use what you have to get what you want. That is what we need. English, if you feel speak up, speak up. If you struggle to speak English, it's not because you can't speak English, but because in English, they say, as an actor, there's a stage fright. So the first time, when you are 16, 14, and you go on the stage, you are scared. You are wetting yourself. You are shitting yourself. It's called stage fright. Me, I am a trained actor, and I have my certificates. But I knew along the line that acting is not my calling. I wanted to do architecture. They say it could take seven years. I say, ah, seven years of my life for oh, a day in England. What can go happen? So if I do uh, seven years and I am not, uh, I don't know, uh, Prince Charles and their associates, I'm not associated. After seven years, I don't go get a job. Now here and talk, say, be like, say, my brain, they say, make you go do this ITO. Be like, say, this IT now you're calling now. Remember when me and my comrades and our generation was doing IT, we did not know IT is going to go mega. We took IT as an interest and 
a position when we do degree we will be employable that is why me and my comrades went to do it when the millennium bug and the millennium situation of a clock that they haven't recognized 1990 can go to zero again nine we say we enter money where we no plan we come do meta mede we can't do chile chile we come use the opportunity we can't make big money we can't become darosha we can't become money ritualists money enter area but not every one of us use that money judiciously and wisely to today wake up and see what they have done with their money not everybody and I can't castigate anybody for doing wrong and um, looking to uh, for gratification on that time rather than looking at the future. If they come to me, I don't advise them. So make we look at this thing holistically now on English. Now we say make we look at it broadly. Now we say make we enter area. Now we say make we respect each other. Now we say make we respect everybody's take and talking when we they talk this matter nobody they better than anybody we are the same my mama and baba they born five children uh, the one girl first one boy second one boy third one boy they get the fourth one then get twins then are five boys now they retire so it doesn't matter but we are born differently we engage differently we excel differently we moderate ourselves in life differently but collectively when we use our common sense if you go to work you have to engage if your manager uh cause you upset you can't go in there and say lose your job to go and fight manager but if i upset you here you can then go and collect my family life where you can find it and come and castigate me on the internet me have before you start i've forgiven you but when you are promoting me i've swallowed your destiny but because your destiny is rubbish when it comes my way i stop it i call my boys we go to ishiwo joint we take pepper soup we take guinness we take star we take gouda your destiny with carry am, eat ishiwu, take pepper soup, take suya, take fish, uh, swallow it with Guinness and Gouda. And then when your destiny was about to find his pit, we come shit, we piss the beer, we come shit the shit of all the food where we don't shit, we come flush your destiny down the toilet. Now so it be because if person no offend you, and you choose to say because you de, you they support your baba, your baba is your father that born you, or your father that brought you up because maybe then go to uh, motherless people's home and go and adopt you. That's your father. Now if you get to my age, sorry oh sorry oh no vex no vex. If you don't lose your papa, it be they say he don't live in life. He's been accomplished in his career. Age, old age is come, and then uh, Baba come go join in ancestor. Mister Joseph Aloba is not a pastor, and is not your Baba. Joseph Aloba is not your father. So don't adopt nothingness. Don't adopt shit. Don't adopt somebody that is a nobody and get on the internet and say, eh, if you come for Baba, I come for you. Use your Iroro, Iroro, Iroro. If you come for Baba, Baba know you. Baba uh, related to you. You'll be Joseph Aloba. Are you a cousin to anybody in Baba? Why you won't carry Baba matter for your head? Wumi, as she did there. The people who want to make sure they support widows and support all that, they are there. But by your Baba, where you they support, waiting, you go get out of Baba, where one inherit his own son's estate. 
The one inherit his own son estate and royalty. Baba, your baba, your baba. Is that a baba? If Joseph Aloba is your baba, and you don't buy, and you are now watching a video of the aftermath of your life, are you going to give Baba trophy? Congratulate him to want to inherit you when he should have left it to the wife and the child of Mobad that Mobad did not deny the child and the wife when he was alive. That's where we are. Biological technicalities doesn't matter. If I bring up a child from age zero and I find out that even my wife cheated, and there is a DNA problem. I will keep it between me and my wife, and I will carry on looking after that child. I will carry on being the father of that child. Inconsequences happens in life. It is not important, and it's not civil for everything that is wrong. You just go in there and just eye on it. Look, your wife has been noble to you, and whatever you've been, even you as a man, maybe you don't even she, she don't carry a shana. You don't do all sort of. Okay, your wife did one, and it's another man that hey, you don't bring up the child. Get on with it. Don't let this life kill you. Enjoy the show. Enjoy the life, and don't take something to your grave that your generation behind will later regret. So, uh, who is next? Speak. Thank you. BB is nice. Oh, BB, my brother. Okay, let me tell you about BB, my brother. He's a wonderful man. It's a, are you still single? Yes. Yeah, it's a single man. Uh, it's a very judicious and a very hardworking man. He's a well set man. Are you half Ghanaian and half Nigerian? Yes. Yeah, so it's a beautiful guy. He lives in Nigeria. Yes, you live in Abuja? Yes. So he's embedded himself into our culture. He's our brother. He understands. Um, do you understand, Awusa? Yes. Oh, you see, this is blessed. You, you understand Yoruba? Yes. And you can speak both? Yes. Oh, by Igbo? No. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. You see, I'm selling him. I have to sell him. He's a noble brother. He's a kind brother. He's a beautiful man. Because when you say beautiful, people say, you're supposed to say he's handsome. No. Beauty in the uh, 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 heart of a human being is that you are soft inside, you are conscious, you are accommodating, you support your brothers and sisters, and you don't judge people. You don't just get in there and start judging. So my noble brother, speak. Thank you very much. In fact, I'm frag a basket. <laughs> my brother, Speak pigeon yeah. if you have to. Okay, I'm not good in pigeon, but uh, I will try to modify. Uh, thank you for all this eloquent. Uh, uh, you, on, you, you, I know, I know, I know. You are overwhelmed. I've given you yes, two points. Yeah. To the point that you are, you are now you soft in the me and uh, you're soft me in the now. Thank you very much. That is the beauty of the black app. So for me to start with, uh, you see, uh, Wumi, I don't know if it's right for me to mention the name. She brought... Uh, sorry, sorry, the... sorry, sorry, um, um, uh, sorry, Bibi. So what is happening uh, on my platform is that uh, don't be shy to name name. Don't be shy to call, but don't drag, yeah? So if you have to call call if it's joseph aloba if it's wumi it doesn't matter call but i just don't want the injustice of us yeah, I, I get it. and so, using this platform to come and pass wala so speak pigeon if you have to drop english yeah, I'm not if, if pigeon in works out better for for you to say something just my own freestyle is that's it so carry on my brother thank you so you see this young lady uh brought this uh, upon herself from the angle I come from and from what I have seen since the exception of this uh, justice for Mobad. Uh, I wish the lady, first lady is around or if she's in the comment section and she can hear me. Uh, look, uh, the woman that we know 
when this issue happened, and for some of us who have been following him from the inception, now, in African culture and in Yoruba culture, when you lose your husband, at least you, you, you need to mourn him for some time. And that is why even in some culture, when you lose your husband, you are restricted to a particular dress that you wear for some month or year before you can change. Now, when this gentleman, I, this young lady, she came out telling us, using all kinds of name to address the late husband. Name like Nega. Who does that? Number two, there was a time she came out making a video in Yoruba language and saying that Abiyama ye egbami. Now, look, Baba might have attend naming ceremony. Baba might have attend engagement. That is not still stop anyone or Baba calling for DNA of this uh, uh, grandson. Court of public opinion, and when I say court of public opinion, it means the streets. We on the black app, we have the right. Mobad is not just an ordinary person. Mobad, look, in Yoruba, people like Mobad, they call him a Konda Omo. Mobad is a special child. Besides that, he's a celebrity. Let me, hold on, hold on, Bibi. Let me bring something up. When Aristocrats, my noble friend, interviewed Prime Boy, um, I remember Prime Boy himself sort of like um, uh, quite emotional. And he said, when we are close, my friend, I call Mobad Idon. Idon in English from Yoruba is magic. That means they call him dog monkey. And Idon is a noble person that entertains people. Um, but what you see is not always what you get, but they always find a way to fog you and that is it done so the name we call ourselves on the street in a group in the bedroom when there is a union between a man and a woman will manifest itself to the public when we get emotional and people will say ah is that what you call him in the bedroom and they laugh and all that kind of stuff and um uh, on this account my nigger it just came up. It's just one of those kind of things that you don't think about it because you, husband and wife, you call each other my nigger. And um, we need to enlighten ourselves and actually know that. The word nigger, we know uh, how derogatory it is to uh, black people. But I have my guys that I meet and I say my nigger, as Denzel Washington would say my nigger so yeah it, it happens that we can express ourselves and um, be loose and be human be human be irresponsible because we're having fun and then label ourselves not label ourselves but just acknowledge one another by a pseudonym by an alias by anything so if, 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 if the woman say, my nigga don't buy, of course, what's wrong with that? And I am not saying it to detest anything. I am not saying it to lambast BB, but I just want us to understand that this kind of things happens. It just happens. You can just call me a name. Someone can just come from the door and say something. And my wife called me to the corner and say, what did he just call you? I see the way you responded. So is this what you guys are doing? 
So if the label constitutes looseness and constitutes going on the street and chasing after a woman, my wife is attacking me to say, when they call you down, why did you not reject it? It is probably my previous life and my engagement with these people, and we don't do our do. <laughs> we're not saying we're doing it now, but we don't do our do. They don't label us then, but they don't give us a name. Because when I joined this black app, I, the IT guy, I changed my name to Demi. My name, first name is Ademola. So the abridged version of it is Demi. So when I changed it, Demi Bombastic, I try Bombastic. I try all my handles on uh, Facebook and all that kind of stuff. Then I am now talking now. I don't change my name. They are still calling me IT guy. And I'm thinking, no, 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 no. I don't change my name. But because you can recognize my voice, mute yourself, please. Mute yourself, African television. African television, mute yourself, please. Uh, so because if they've labeled me as the IT guy, I can't get away from it. So I decided, okay, let me go back to my roots, change everything on, on this black app to the IT guy. And then it sticks. So woman's nigger is Mobad and Mobad's nigger or Mobad's bitch. I don't know. Because it's woman that is saying nigger. Maybe Mobad is saying my bitch. We don't know because he's no longer alive. So their bedroom name and their street name that they label themselves that they used to uh, uh, engage. Let's not take it lightly. So if we may say my nigger, she has a right to say it. Unfortunately, it may not dwell well with us at a difficult time. We thought maybe she should have been judicious and think wisely before she uses it. But because of emotions, she's used it and we just have to forgive that so my brother carry on yeah i want to make a request can you make me your moderator please uh, how do i do that uh, let me see. Let me see. hold on hold on let me see yeah you, what do you want to do you do you want to do something devilish no 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 <laughs> no some <laughs> people are <laughs> making a request <laughs> that uh, you bring them up then yeah. again when people come up they yes, come up yes. with noise so okay. i just want to help okay, you in okay, handling okay. those stuff. I, I think i'm like getting them, them up uh, and muting them that's okay. it they, 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 they they with me. i think i will find you so you will be my only moderator for now so are you my moderator now can you see okay. yourself as my moderator because i've just i'm no. ah, okay please come up not uh, yet bb are you okay now? Can you moderate now? Mm, let me see. Okay. I, I want someone to tell me how I can make my screen bigger so that I can see everybody properly. I can see myself, yeah. but my screen Just is click, a click on your click your on your screen. Click okay. on your screen. Yes. Yeah. And then what do I do? Have, have you done that? Then I you will see. My screen. I put myself there, but I want the screen to be bigger so that I can see small on the comment section. And they want no, your screen cannot be bigger than this. Eh? Your screen cannot be bigger than no, this. No, 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 no. Don't worry. Don't worry. Okay, let's do this. Let's do something. Are you able to moderate now? Let me. No, I have to come down and come up again. Okay. Okay. Go down, and I'll bring you back. Okay. Okay, African Television, you have the mic. IT, um, first, you see, I want to address some things that have been mentioned on this platform today. Carry on, my brother. Things that I, things that I think people need to understand. Okay. First one, one of your panelists mentioned that uh, Ah, we should stop that, we do with things. respect african television hold on african television hold on hold on baby hold on baby are you oh, able to i moderate? was on the floor hold on, i was on, on the baby. floor are you able to moderate now no i just made you a moderator now okay may, maybe it's the network uh yeah it too it too, uh, i will do that maybe it's okay, the network okay, allow african tv to speak african television please carry on thank you this this moderator don't be muting and blocking us so no i don't want i don't want you say with me personally i don't want any moderator i just want people to come up and speak uh -huh. um so the problem is when people get frustrated they drop off because you've invited them aristocrat come up i beg 
Aristocrat, where are you? Aristocrat, I beg, come up, come up. That is what some moderators do. They will be bullying, bullying us. Yeah, with no, no, no. I, 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 look, to be honest, I don't want moderators. Yeah. I just because we have banter with them. So far, so matter. far, okay, people. We know it's that, it's that. We know we haven't got justice, but let's solemnly come together and acknowledge. The the, the 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 life of this guy celebration of life means even if someone is young of any age when family bury their home they celebrate their life celebration of life is not fire cannon celebration of life is not anything other than let's sit together let's think about the best time of their life let's think about when they make us happy let's think about when they are sad Let's think about our experience with them. That is how we celebrate life. And that is what we would have brought together. Okay, you don't want African TV to do competition, fine. But allow African TV to bring it down. I went on so many platforms. I engaged with Gorexi. Speak to Baba. Let's find a truce. Let's leave this thing. Two weeks later, three weeks later, one month later, Baba decided that he's going to go to court with um, African TV. And I tried. I tried. That's the kind of person I am. I think we should be able to live together in harmony. And I think that when we have issues, we have to come together collectively, correct our misgivings, be friends again, even if we have to fake it. But at least let's put a little bit of Iroro in the process and uh, 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 do things harmoniously. And then all of a sudden, you, Mr. Joseph Aloba, that is saying you don't want people to benefit from the demise of your son. Uh, what happened? Uh, you set up a band. You did 70-30 with um Olori um, Ebi. Hold on, let me, let me finish. I will, I will drop it. I will, I will give it to you now. Then you went and then you set up your band and then now you are monetizing Access Bank, Wema Bank, GoFundMe. It doesn't matter. The public put money in there. I don't want transparency from you anymore. I don't want any form of accountability from you anymore. The money that is in, uh, put into Access Bank, Wema Bank and uh, GoFundMe is rightfully yours. Keep it. But let's be real. Let's be real. The reality of the matter is actually that let's be judicious, let's actually think as human beings and let's actually know any utterance and anything you do may not impact people, the traditional people that champion your ideas and say he lost his son. I don't want to say the other bit that we upset anybody. Um, it's unfortunate that you lost your son. Uh, from the bottom of my heart, my uh, utmost condolences to you and your family. And I pray that such doesn't happen to your family. Distance away from um, uh, that kind of a uh, uh, process of, uh, of mourning and all this kind of stuff. And I kind of hope that the children you have now, that uh, they will supersede Mobad's sort of like success. They will give you joy and they will do better even not better than mobile but even more and give you joy and you will live long and all that kind of and i i really mean that but the thing is that there are feelings there are carelessness and if we need to call you out we are not dragging you if you come and say if you come for baba i will come for you use your brain you can't come for me and i haven't come for baba i am just stating the facts the way i see it is my opinion the disclaimer, uh, you my sound opinion. very low. So carry on, carry on. No, you sound a little bit low. So maybe to you, I'm speaking. I, I don't have anything I can change here. Can everybody hear me properly? Can everybody hear me properly? Comment section, just say you can hear me properly. Yes, yeah, you, you were very old. You had to set out your environment. So the lady that said you can't hear me properly, speak, please. Thank you. Oh, sorry. It was my phone volume. Okay, speak, 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 speak. No, I'm just listening to you. I don't have really nothing well, to say. Why don't you want to speak? You've come up. You have to speak. Oh. Yes, that's why you come no, no, up. No, no, you don't she, want to speak. She, you stay in the comment section. Where? If you don't have any... No, don't, uh, 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 no, 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 don't interject. I'm having one-to-one -one with this lady. If you don't want to speak, don't request. If you come up and you don't want to speak, you can drop yourself. But now that you are here i believe you've got something to say it doesn't matter what please speak thank you okay um how's the dna process so far how 
How's it going? Okay, let's let's put it this way. Let's put it this way. We had we had a situation one year ago, thirteen months ago. Yeah. Okay. Uh, somebody died, and we thought he died on you know on judiciously and all that kind of stuff. Okay, he's gone to inquest. Yeah. Let's forget about everything now. Um, they want to bring the DNA into it, and the magistrate said no. It's a family matter, right? Okay. So. Now that it's become a family matter, Wumi has always said it from the inception, if you want a DNA, you need to go for the legal process. So the legal process is taking this long. The legal process has now come to play. Now, when the legal process actually go to the family court, um, it will be that the court will decide, will adju adjudicate on the matter and make a decision on how it goes. Now, Wumi's lawyer would have engaged with Baba's lawyer, and there is always an allowance for them to go sideways and go and negotiate and decide, rather than wait for the court ruling, they can decide to mitigate between themselves and agree terms. So whichever way it comes, I don't care. Whether it's Wumi that requests it, whether it's a lawyer that did this, at the end of the day, Wumi has now agreed to do the DNA. Yeah. So now that it's agreed to do the DNA, I still believe it's a family matter that need to remain with the family. Let them go and do it. Let the judicial process and our courts administer that process. Now, when they bring the outcome to us and we are not happy with the process and we question anything, it's still not our problem. It's still their problem. There is no public outcry here. There is no exhumation of a body here. It is a family matter between Joseph Aloba Union as a family with Wumi's family who married Joseph Aloba's son and they are independent in their own right, in their own life. If the demise of this guy allow a member of the other side to question the paternity of the child, it doesn't matter how we do it, our judicial process is actually spoken. We may say, go and bring paper. You bring paper. They say they go do them, they're not go do them. We may come talk, say she go do them. Now where she talks, say she go do them. Where she never do, where then go no conduct. Let's leave the same process that brought about the exhumation. The same process will answer to this one. And then with the outcome, we know happy. We have to go to hell. It's got nothing to do with us. If you are not happy with the outcome of the DNA between the family and the court, go to hell. It's got nothing to do with you. Carry on. Carry on, my lady. Okay. Any, any more question that I can judiciously answer with my little jurisprudence on the matter? Anyone? Mm -hmm. Huh? Oh, who's next? Anybody? Unmute yourself and speak. Thank you. Anybody? Freestyle. Is this is freestyle? Go, go, go. Anybody? Unmute yourself and speak. Okay. Uh, what I wanted to talk about, we've addressed it uh, earlier on when BB said uh, we may call the Mubad nigga and all that. We've addressed that. Yeah. Yes. That's fine. Yeah, I mean, look, uh, madam, oh, um, sorry, my screen is playing tricks on me. Oh, oh, uh, is it the lady? What is it? What's your name again? I can't see you properly. That's the problem. First lady, first lady. First lady, yeah, first lady. My, my madam, okay. I, I love you and I, I trust and I trust you. I agree to, sir. Because I've been on platform. You speak judiciously. You speak respectively. And you don't do what to what like me because me i do what to what to <laughs> we are not just going to bring it here mm. you understand so the we are human beings and we are fallible which means say english say fallible means say you can make mistake that is how we are made we are not ai artificial intelligence we are no bots or robots we are human beings we go to bed, we go and shit. One day you are saying to people, I will meet you tomorrow. You fall sick in the morning, you can't meet them. That is how our life is. That is the, the dynamics of our lives and how we shape ourselves. Now, if we support Baba 
and we are looking for justice for Mobad, and we are not supporting Baba or Wumi, or you're supporting Wumi, it's fine. We are going to get to the same place. Do you know where we're going to get to? Justice for Mobad. Whether the justice that is served doesn't actually seem clean, and we see it as injustice, and we start another fight, it doesn't matter. The police that you don't like is your friend. The police is not going to come and wash your bum bum. And the police is not going to come and clean your teeth. But the police will do the best the police can do. But without the police, the route to justice may be very far-fetched. Yeah, We don't have to trust anybody. But the people that are in the process, that have to think and advocate on our behalf, we have to respect them. So I respect the Nigerian police. We don't have any other police. They're not going to go to South Africa and go and bring South Africa and Zimbabwe or America or UK police to come and help us. It's our thing. inside her question. She said, uh, yeah. she said you should explain uh, how a woman called mobile nigger. No, 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 no. She said, I have answered the question already by explaining the situation with women calling women nigger. You get it? Okay. We've discussed it maybe before you joined. No, because or... she just, yeah, I understand you were in the process of ending the explanation before I joined. But okay, she let came me, and let asked. Me, let, me, let, me, let me break it down. She asked again. She asked yeah. again. No, I no, said, let me, let me, let me break I it down said again. he already uh, cleared that part. He said I've cleared oh, okay, it. Okay. For, okay. Your own my, benefit, my fault. My fault. For your own benefit. Let me break it down again. My fault. Okay. So we live a life, we have accolades. We are friendly with people, they love us, we love them, we call ourselves name, we label ourselves. Um, when Aristocrat did uh, an interview with um, Prime Boy, Prime Boy made it known to us that um, when they were young and all that kind of stuff, he had uh, a code name for Mobad by the name Idon. And Idon is like magic. Now you see me, now you don't. So in a very playful way, Mobad was Idon. So Prime Boy, especially, and a number of people, whether you call him Promise, whether you call him whatever, and I'm sure at the time nobody would even be addressing him as Mobad because Mobad was a state name. Now, women can call Mobad my nigga, and Mobad can call women my bitch. We don't know what the bedroom name for women is from Mobad because it's no longer with us. But we know that uh, association name between Wumi and Mobad is my is a nigger or my nigger or whatever the case may be. And I said also in emphasis that uh, me with my friends, I have few friends. I would say, hey, what's up, my nigger? And I always remember Denzel Washington. And I also need to tell you that I am a trained actor. I just did not decide to go to follow that path because God probably had a calling for me and is IT and is not uh, acting. So that's the reason why sometimes when I'm minding my business, people are asking me if I'm okay, asking me if I've been drinking, asking me if I'm drunk, I'm an actor. I can act drunk, I can act anything. I can interject you and do woto woto needlessly because I am an actor, I'm just like Yomi. Yomi is an actor. I am an actor. I am just an actor that did not choose to go the acting, the professional way. Because there are other ways I can use my brain, make money from IT, use other brain on this side to make money in other areas. IT is simple for me because I'd be like, say, when God created me, God wanted me to do IT. So IT was simple for me. Uh, acting is going to take me away from my life. Uh, it's just not going to do something that I champion, but I train in that department, but it's me that I need to make up my mind that it's not my calling. So it wasn't my calling. So, um, so going back to the labeling and all the name calling and all that kind of stuff, uh, Wumi can say my nigga and, 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 and uh, um, Mobile can say my bitch, but it's their own commonality, it's their own experience, it's their own space. As a um, uh, prime boy will say, Idon. Idon is like um, Balu Balu. It is magic. It's, you see me now, you don't see me. So 
it is not a big deal, but it is not um, a kind of connotation, a colloquial that you can use. Uh...